in this wilderness of samsara. It is for whom that you are looking. No relatives are really yours, who, caught within the net of this false maya, have forgotten the truth of your own self. Just find out who you are. You wanton with the billows of desire, thinking that they are yours. But never once you think of who you are, whence you were born, and what are parents, what are relatives, and what your friends. When in this dream, woven by false desires, the actor's part you play, you have forgotten the knowledge of the truth. In this dark mire of grief, now lying drunk, you never try to find out your own self. Your wanderings in samsara all are due to the allurement of expectancy. Remember who you are and whence you come. Forgetting your real home lost in the dark of ignorance, for the sake of wealth, others, youth, all transitory things. And though the end of all must come in the cremation ground, O oh, erring jiva, Still you do not come unto your senses. Always wavering beneath the influence of your desires, of anger, and of covetousness. You place poison's bitter cup unto your lips, in preference to the nectar that is there. You, who were born to karma's ties, a slave, who are you? Whence do you come and whither go?
desire and anger, avarice and love, enchanting youth, fame, honour, wealth, are all the dream of expectation. Know for sure that certain death doth stare you in the face. partner, children and family resemble naught but stray acquaintances that you've picked up upon the way. The knowledge of truth lost, you have forgotten your own self. and are enduring weal and woe and pangs of birth. O thou who art an ignorant jiva, give up men, women, money and expectancy. By lighting up the lamp of knowledge, Bring enlightenment within. Be quick to rise up from the darkness of black ignorance. Seek the abode of bliss where there exists not a distinction between mine and thine. And throw away all hate and shame and fear. And for your ignorance, there's not a doubt others will make a laughing stock of you.
one who is under influence of ire, desires and avarice, can never be free from their bondage. Father, mother, wife, husband, children and family, all ties by Maya wrought. Cut them away using discrimination's keen-edged blade. The body idea you must first give up. Humiliate the ego. Lift the veil of darkness and proceed along the path that leads to peace. Then, some will welcome you, while others as a weakling will despise. Don't look to anyone. Remain unmoved. There, at your goal, is found no happiness, no misery, nor any turmoil there. I is always quiet, calm, seat of pure bliss. Religion, irreligion, birth or death, virtue or vice. The threefold bondage of dark misery. The scope for more than one or absence of this scope. Besides knowledge of all duality, there don't exist.
the Supreme Self alone. It is that, that is. Supreme luster am I, I am everlasting, good. Fully aware am I, devoid of death, decay. I have not any fear. I am eternal, whole, and free from throbs of thought. No intellect have I, no body, nor a mind. My real nature's bliss. No hunger, neither thirst, nor ego have I got. No wish have I. I am free from every sort of change. No father, mother, Son, daughter, or family have I. No duty, birth or death, do not pertain to me. (laughs) 